All right, solving this problem, so I can rewrite this as three raised to the x over three raised to, or excuse me, five raised to the x equals seven raised to the one minus seven raised to the x. Yeah. Or actually, hold on. So I take the natural log of these, so I end up with a natural log of 3 raised to the x minus natural log of 5 raised to the x is equal to natural log of 7 minus natural log of 7 raised to the x. Furthermore, I can go x natural log of 3 minus x natural log of 5 is equal to natural log of 7 minus x natural log of 7. So what I can do now is move the x's over, so I get x natural log of 3 minus x natural log of 5 plus x natural log of 7 equals natural log of 7. And the cool thing here is I can factor out an x, so I get x natural log of 3 minus natural log of 5 plus natural log of 7 equals natural log of 7. So what we end up with here is um, it ends up being just x is equal to natural log of 7 over natural log of 3 minus natural log of 5 plus natural log of 7. And what we get is approximately um, 1.356 if you round to three decimal places. All right, that's it.